You don't knock. Are you putting KY and jelly on his phone receiver? An exploding snake in his drawer? No. I'm placing his Vicodin stash with laxatives. Don't. Don't stoop to his level. Why? Because he's suddenly gonna realize he's no longer 14. Either I take his garbage forever, or I give him a reason to stop. You don't have to make him miserable. Just make him think that he's one. I'm not gonna fire a foreman. I said think he's one. Find some other way to soothe his ego. The thing's big enough. You must be able to find some corner to polish. Where were you two hours ago? Where were you? What do you have? High titers to histoplasmosis. Probably lived in the Ohio River Valley. Also weakly positive on coccidiomycosis. Weak means older. Means moved to Ohio from the San Joaquin Valley. Or he happened to visit California. It's also positive for Chagas disease. Central America. Or he kissed his maid from El Salvador. Or he sat next to someone from Belize on a flight to Weehawken. Or he ate lettuce from Honduras. Yes, you're right, buzzkill. This tells us next to nothing. But since that's on the something side of nothing, thought we'd go with it. His rash is back. Hot tub isn't hot enough to keep his body warm. So we take his body out of the picture. Let's hit him from the inside. Lipopolysaccharide. LPS won't just give him a fever. He could hit 110, fry his brain. Or make him just toasty enough to keep his blood flowing free, like my bowels. You smell that? Not gonna get sweeter. You nailed Brennan for seeing what he wanted to see. You're no different. But you are. You used to like this stuff. You left here because you didn't like what you were turning into. You like who you are now? You like being Cuddy's errand boy? That was just a courtesy flush. I'm not actually done. You want to induce a fever? Well, unless you're willing to don a white t-shirt and hop into the hot tub with him, I need another way to keep him warm or he dies. You could maim him. I could cure him. I'm not letting you do it. Are you gonna fire me? No. Wait a second, what the hell was that? You were won over by my soaring rhetoric? I basically just threatened to hold my breath. You never intended to stop me. You just pretended to stop me so you could pretend to fail to stop me so you could stroke my ego. Ah, war doesn't end until Foreman's gone. Foreman's not going anywhere. And I know when my Vicodin isn't Vicodin. Do you know when your birth control pills aren't birth control pills? I got you a job. Mount Zion Hospital in Boston. They have a great diagnostics department. Gilchrist City, take you anyway. That was very nice of you. Oh. God, does everything have to be about you? It's simple math. I'm not gonna back down, you're not gonna back down, Cuddy's not gonna back down, no one's gonna be happy here. And Cuddy's gonna end up pregnant. What? Doesn't matter. Are you saying, what is you having sex? It starts Monday. I can help you pack. I don't want the job. Well, I mean, why not? You're miserable. Apparently not. Well, you're gonna be. Are you smiling? No. Do your own stupid biopsy. It can wait. Uh, he has a temperature of 107. It can wait 15 minutes. You know where Cuddy is? Hi, I'm the Dean of Medicine. Hi, I'm the guy who saved your life. So what if it's house? Then I take the job at Mount Zion. There is no job at Mount Zion. House said that- Well, if house said it, it must be true. I can fire him. I can fire him now. I can fire him tomorrow. I don't even need a she reason. She doesn't fire me. She never will fire me. She needs He's me. a good doctor, that's all. I respect his expertise and I- She's hot for me, always. Shut up. Well, that could have been either of us. You have great yabos. Still could have been either of us. You lose. Seriously. 
I have always thought my breasts were one of my best features. Damn. You all suck. Two of you took 14 hours to find a car. You forgot to mention that the guy with no memory had memories. If you keep on thinking that insane guys have hidden wisdom, you're gonna wind up shooting people on a subway. Something. So, which one of us sucks the most? It's a tie. Between? All of you. We're all fired? None of you are fired. That was nice of you. Sure. Why didn't you fire anyone? They're good doctors. Right. Why didn't you let Brennan quit? He's a good doctor. Right. By not letting anyone go, you made six people happy and one person happy and rich. Chase won every one of those bets. So either you're just really nice or what's your cut? 50%. How bad do you want to keep your job? I'll keep my mouth shut. Hey, you actually do want to stay, don't you? I think I do. Every one of those idiots got some insight about themselves from the pig salesman. Not one of them did anything about it. People don't learn, they don't change. You did. You're a freak. 